The people of Tersin community in Guer West and Makurdi local government areas of Benue State have come out to protest over the recent killing of about 25 persons by armed men suspected to be herders. The leaders of the Development Association, Professor Joseph Kaka, who had led the protest mainly youths or protest of mainly youths and women, expressed displeasure over the non-activeness of the army stationed in the communities. This protest is a result of the recent killing of over 20 persons, including nine members of a single family and some personnel of the state volunteer guards. Our husbands have been targeted, have been killed, leaving us to cater for our children, which is not easy for us. If we go to most of these IDP, IDP camps, it's women that are staying there. The husbands go out to, to fend for the family, leaving us, so it has not been so easy. We are tired and we have reported, and it appears there is a fed system. We are living under a fed system, right from the federal down to the local government. Nothing, the, the efforts are not being made to rescue our people from what they are going through. These protesting residents have been displaced from their ancestral homes since 2011, with the majority of them still living in camps for internally displaced persons in Naka and Agagwe communities. According to protesters, the incessant attacks, kidnappings and killings of residents were becoming unbearable and have called on the federal government to replace the military personnel posted to the area. When we lose a person, we have to go and pay the military money to take us to go and bury such people. If we want to go to the farm, we have to go and pay the military to protect us to go and do the farm work. Enough is enough. And we are making these demands that the government at the level of state and federal should immediately come to our aid. We need security that will protect lives and property. We don't need security that will be destroying life. The security we need here, we need civil defense and the MOPO. I think those ones will help us. The leaders of the communities noted that if nothing urgent is done, the invading armed headers will succeed in their land grabbing mission in parts of Guer West and McCurdy local government areas. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.